Well, what a lovely, lovely day. Absolutely glorious weather here as we welcome you to a football match of considerable significance. Great consequence in this part of the world. They've been talking about this one for a while and they have rolled up to it in fantastic numbers. You should have seen the roads outside the ground in the hour or two leading up to it. It has been bumper to bumper. The traffic has been extraordinary. But the level of expectation is also very, very high. And uh, these supporters who uh, were queuing round the block for their tickets as soon as we knew the date of the fixture, well, now they can't wait for it to begin. And begin it will any second now. So what a stage for the players to take to here ahead of such an important game. Bordeaux has got the juices flowing, and now this. Watering game this between two very high quality sides a treat for everybody here oh get ready for some high grade football peter two strong teams as you say full of wonderful individual talent and we have every right to anticipate some really entertaining football as to whether we'll see a high scoring contest that's a little harder to predict i'm not complaining though because there are good players everywhere you look around this surface and that's a fine start in itself There's the whistle, and here we go. Jim, who do you pick out as the telling individual today? Yeah, Robert Lewandowski. He's just about the perfect all-round striker. Not least because he can finish equally well with both feet, Peter. It's not all about his finishing, though. He's always on the shoulder, looking for that ball in behind, and that prevents the opposition defence from getting too high or, indeed, getting too comfortable. Hard to disagree with that. It is the sort of situation he thrives in. Look at the defender bombing forward. And the ball is out of play. Krasicki. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. He wasn't very far from making something happen by himself. Lovely to see. Brandt. And it's played forward. And here's Canabri. Gets up to head it! He's pulled off a fine save. Well, you can't ask for much more than that. A difficult moment he simply had to deal with. Poland going about it patiently, perhaps too patiently. No change to the score, nil-nil it remains. Dracoviak spreads it towards the left. Plays it out to the wing. Beautifully done. Tries to get it forward quickly. Out to the right. Now it's Canabri. Rudiger. 
plays it into the box. Going for goal! Well, he should have done better, and he knows it. A more than decent attempt, Peter. Zielinski. It's come loose. It's Lewandowski! Oh, that is asking for trouble. Kimmich drives it forward. Werner. Pings it out wide. Brandt. It's a very good battle there, terrific to watch. Well, the further he went, the more attention he attracted. There was just way too much pressure for him to get the shot away. And here's Krasitsky. And helps available out wide. Oh, great shapes to shoot! It's in! And always such a great time to score. A brilliant boost before you head in for half-time, and you can guarantee that dressing room will be buzzing now. He does it all with an air of efficiency and simplicity. Yeah, that's brilliant from him. Such a, a calm finish. Just pick your spot, don't think about what the keeper's going to do, concentrate on what you have to do. Germany take the lead, 1-0. Well, just listen to the reaction. I think you can hear the approval from the support all around the stadium. Brandt. Kimmich. Gundogan. Ginter, and the first half is done, and there we are, off they go for half-time, the breakthrough did indeed come in the first half, but there has only been that one goal, if themselves on the back too, they work tirelessly for me. Germany head into the dressing room, pleased with the thought that they have that all-important lead, analysis to come during the break. Already up and running for the second half. Germany really need to go and, and grab another goal now, Peter, if they're going to go on and secure this. Out for a throw. Gundogan. And the through ball is intercepted. Zielinski. And the counter is on. Get the better of his opposite number. Pass needed to be better than that, and he knows it. Timely intervention. Zielinski. Gets it back. Bednarek. Almost an hour gone. Your impression so far, Jim? Well, Peter, if they're attempting to see out the game with such a, a narrow advantage, there's room for trouble. Uh, it goes for goal! Their attempt, just the wrong outcome.
Good effort, very good effort. He would have at least wanted to make the keeper work, though. Hoists it forward. Gnabry. Werner. Gundogan. Germany got their goal at the end of the first half. And the score is 1-0. Well, they can break here. Krasicki. More than happy to take the muscular approach. Brandt. Krasitsky. Bednarek. Forward it goes. Good challenge, excellent challenge. Peter, they have to fight the onset of desperation and keep enough cool heads to still deliver. And that's sprayed out wide. Brunch towering header! They've done it! Two up and threatening to pull clear! A lovely header, but really, it was all about the delivery. Well, look, it's it's often the timing of the jump that dictates what you can do with any header, and if you get it slightly wrong, then you'll struggle, but that was beautifully met, it really was. Poland have turned to their bench, and we're going to have a substitution. Yeah, it's about time I think we saw some activity from the bench, but it's it's debatable as to what level of impact can be made from here. It's it's pretty late. So that's two now without reply. Gnabry. Gnabry! Oh, just lacked a decent finish. Look, it, it was achievable, Peter, but it needed his best. Doesn't get the pass he's looking for. Brzezicki certainly knows how to use the shimmy to very good effect. Ginter plays it forward. Two minutes to be added on. Krakowiak gets wrestled off the ball. Brandt played out to the right. And a header! And the ball's come out. Oh, real danger here. Real chance! They are rampant! And the lead is three! It is surely done! Lovely goal, perfect poise to set himself for the strike.
three with... And in time is up, and there goes the whistle. Germany a class apart, opponents torn apart, they are comprehensive winners. How would you sum up what we've witnessed, Jim? Look, we saw some textbook football from white areas that continued to produce expansive attacking play that was...